What's going on today, FG fam? And today we have another potential new series that could be coming to the channel if you guys support it enough. If you want this series to come to the channel, you've got to drop as many likes as possible, obviously one per person. You also have got to comment every time I ask some kind of a question for you guys to let me know in the comment section down below. That really helps as well, as well as sharing the video to any social media platform you can figure a way to share this video too by hitting that share button that is down below as well also hit the subscribe button if you're brand new to the channel but today we are going to get into march madness legacy now if you don't know what that is and you know of college football revamp march madness legacy is pretty much the same thing but with ncaa basketball 10 now i have never attempted even a regular NCAA Basketball 10 Legacy on this channel or Dynasty Mode, whatever you want to call it. Today we try that and we are doing it with the Syracuse Orange. Don't go anywhere. Okay, so here we are ready to open up this dynasty and we are creating the coach, Juice Manley of our New York Knicks franchise series that we did a little bit ago, just ended a couple months ago. If you haven't checked that out, it will be linked in the end screen if you're looking for some more basketball franchise content. But we are, of course, going to be doing my favorite school the Syracuse Orange and the reason mainly why we're doing this I know they're a very good team considered in this game but we are doing this team because their court is done their jerseys are done there are of course some other teams that are done as well Duke being one of them but we are going to be doing the Syracuse Orange my favorite squad they got all the stuff done, so no reason not to. I also love Buddy Bayheim. We got to use him. It's got to be done. And that's, of course, if you guys want to see this series continue. So if you want to see this as a series on the channel, even if it's a mini series or whatever, let me know in the comments section below. We are going to be running exactly what I found on Operation Sports, which is 18-minute halves. I don't know how long this is going to take. These games might take a while, so we might only do so many games in a season. But these are the sliders that were used there as far as global settings. And I'm taking, of course, the commentary off because I do not appreciate somebody talking over me in videos. This is the overlook of Syracuse, Pipeline States, Colorado. That one's interesting. Connecticut, Delaware, Massachusetts, New Hampshire. That's all kind of relative and very much expected other than Colorado. But our roster's looking pretty good. They do play a lot of small ball at Syracuse, a lot of guard play. We might try to recruit a little bit more forwards. I know guards are usually what tends to be interested in Syracuse, but we'll find out in recruiting in just a little bit. Our allocation for points as far as training, offense, defense, all of that stuff, we are going to, of course, go into shooting heavily. That is the kind of team that this is, and I want them to be able to make their shots. Offense and defense, I still want them to do, and conditioning, we don't really want anybody getting hurt, so we're going to give those kind of an even spread. Looking at guys that are interested in the program, that is mainly where I'll be recruiting just because this school obviously has high, high prestige when it comes to basketball. So we'll get good recruits no matter what. I would like to focus on people that would actually like to play for us first and foremost, and then kind of do more of a regionalized type of scouting like for center here nobody's really interested a lot of very lows but I still want a center so we'll try to get the kid from Coney Island why not here's another one I mean there's a medium interest from New Jersey obviously we're gonna go after the four-star South Carolina kid who has high interest but Grady from Lawrenceville New Jersey we're still gonna try to tap into the state that is just 
one to the south so of course why not do that for small forward nobody's really interested here and there isn't really anybody regionalized that close there is a maryland kid but i don't really know what we're going to be able to do with small forward and i do want to pick up one so looking at guards of course here you go this is where everybody's really interested in playing for syracuse they've always had really good guards from the days of Jerry McNamara to the days of Johnny Flynn. I mean, they've just always had good guards on this squad. So, of course, that's what's going to be interested. And we got some A-plus offensive guards that are very much interested in coming to the squad. We're going to put Hamilton. There he is, the Coney Island kid. He's got a defense. That is a guy I'd love to have blocking shots for our squad. We have four scholarships available this year because we have four seniors leaving. So we'll be able to bring in four kids. Our short list is currently at seven, but we've got to go for small forward somehow. There's a couple Jersey kids, Westfield, New Jersey, and West Orange, New Jersey. I'm likely going to be going after both of the Jersey guys. See if we can bring them in. Why not? Over at shooting guard, I mean, why not add those guys that are interested? There is a one-star shooting guard interested in us from New Jersey. That's probably not going to be somewhere we're going to want to allocate points this year. So probably not something we would end up being interested in. Grady from Jersey, we got him in there. Wise from New York, Niagara Falls. That's not too far, you know, from Niagara, New York. We will go for that. And our athletic director is going to add people he's interested in that I will never recruit. Perfect. Awesome. We were invited to the Old Spice Classic, so we'll be taking on CSU when it gets to that time. And again, this part of those slider sets that I found on Operation Sports, the gameplay settings, user versus CPU. So this is what we'll be using. All conference, 18-minute halves. It's going to be tough because I'm not exactly great at basketball games. That is not my area of expertise obviously more of a football and baseball guy as far as having expertise and being able to play the game but we've got a tough schedule and it's going to be fun to play these games so we'll see if you this is a series you guys are interested in we'll be starting our journey off against rutgers then we have alabama we have Oregon at one point there. A lot of close teams between uh, Bucknell and Niagara and Winthrop, all these teams. Cleveland State will be coming in. Then we'll have our Old Spice Classic. We're playing IUPUI, which if you don't know, that's Indiana University of Pennsylvania. So they're not too far away. Maryland will be playing Creighton. We'll be playing the Richmond Spiders, which you can't see on that ticket. Smart ticket, folks. We'll be playing Wofford. We'll be playing Oral Roberts. I know everybody loves Oral. We'll be playing West Virginia. San Jose State will be coming into the Carrier Dome. We'll be playing Iowa, Kansas State. We'll be playing Gonzaga, the number one team in the nation. So that should be really fun to see. I think the schedule is pretty tough. What do you think of the schedule? What would you predict the record to be? Do you think we would make it to the tournament? What seed do you think we'll get? Let me know all of that in the comments section below. And like I said, if this is a series that you want to see continue, I'm going to need to see as many likes as possible on this video. I will be comparing it to other videos that I release. Make sure that you comment down below that you want to see this series, that you are excited for it. And... Of course, your predictions for how a series like this would go. Also, let me know in the comment section below how you'd want to see this series. Would you want to see it much like the video that I made for March Madness Legacy? If you didn't check that video out, I will link that in the end screen as well. So you can take a look. Would you want to see like face cam live com videos, which are not really my forte because I don't get to really talk openly and play the game freely. It's more or less, I'm a little more conscious of what I'm saying while I'm playing the game, but you'll get a lot of let's go reactions when big shots are made. But let me know in the comment section below if you'd want the post com or if you would want the live com with the face cam. Those are all things I'll be considering if this is even a series at all. And if you want to see some more franchise, don't forget to like and subscribe as well as click here for some more franchise. Build you, build some